What is going on guys? Lethal Flux here. Sorry again for a while without a deck profile, but now I've got an updated Burning Abyss deck with uh, next challengers or new challengers, whatever you want to call it. And of Isn't course it it's... Secrets of Eternities? Yeah. Secrets of I'm sorry. Eternity. Secrets of Eternity. My bad. And uh, Baron Reigns over here went undefeated at Locals today. And uh, let's get into the deck profile. Alright. Three of the best card in the world. In the world. My girlfriend, because I don't have a life. Three Seer still? Uh, three the Seer. I think Seer's the best one. Next to my boy Graf, the puppy. And then three of the ugly ass bitch. <laughs> she is pretty ugly. Uh, three of this guy. What is that one? Uh, Rubik. Rubik. I thought about cutting to two, but like, just so good. Virgil is just ridiculous. More and fire like that. Yeah, for the new bays, we got um, Cagna. Yeah, Cagna got the right. Uh, Farfa. Farfa. I'm gonna play Far two of this because I'm cutting Alec. I'm yeah. cutting Alec for too far. Farfa Farfa's is like, really good. In the mirror, they they can't OTK, like, they can't make Acid Golem against you because you're just gonna Farfa and they lose. I saw that. And <laughs> that's how I beat Nico. He yeah. made an Acid Golem, I farfa it. And it came back with zero materials, and he lost. Yeah, he lost. And um, I just think it's a lot better. It's a lot better against Xyz. It's a lot better materials against on, everything. Yeah. <laughs> Three maxis. I'm ready for the hate because I'm not playing MTNS. I think it's outdated information. Yeah, and for sure. Alex, Alexander Thomas agrees with me. I think. Yeah. Oh yeah, he does. Yeah. It's it's like this is against decks like going. Um, going f if they go first, emptiness is useless. Yeah. This is actually playable, yep. and it kind of does the same thing because if they stop, it does the same thing as emptiness. And if they keep going, you're just getting more cards. Bad yeah, pluses. yeah. Sure. I agree with it. And then one be honest. I was thinking about cutting this. Of course. The actually, BLS. because I drew it so many times today without having a way to sell it. And it was just dead. Yeah. That or I got Apocalypse Four Towers. And one game, that was the game, that was the one game that I lost. Yeah. One game that I lost. <laughs> and I just couldn't get over it, so. For sure. I'm probably just gonna side deck Honest, which is gonna make me have to main this. Because Honest is actually a way to get rid of it that's kind of synergetic. I hate Astral Force, it's just so bad. <laughs> so, like, I'm trying to find other outs, and Honest is actually an out for it. So. For sure. Is that the monsters? Yep. How many yep. monsters is that? A lot. That's a uh, lot. It, it just got updated, so I don't know the exact number. Okay. No problem. A lot. Let's move on to the spells. Spells, two good and evils. I played three today. I took the third down out for Ageki because it is so cloggy. Yep, for because sure. Because if you draw it, there's no way to get rid of it other than ditching it with ring bots when you would much rather dis ditch your other stuff. Yeah. But its effect for the Rota is like really good. So two Grab of, fire like <laughs> two, two of that. Um two enemy controller. I made it. I think this card is the nuts. Like if you open one Burning Abyss and this, you're good because yep. they they can't they're not going to do any damage to you because you're going to econ whatever they do. And it's also good against the game one Denko Seka. <clears throat> and Flying C in game two. And Flying C game two and all that stuff. And it's good for OTKs. Uh, three of this MST. Uh, MST because Definitely necessary. It's really good. And then for the one ofs, you got all the Saki cards. You got the Holy Trinity. <laughs> uh, Snatch Steel, Rigiki. I think Rigiki's really good. The, the, I wasn't playing today, but the only like games I lost was because they had a field. Yeah. But I mean, I still ended up winning the match, but like my most troubling times is when they had an oppressive field. So. Allure, which I'm probably going to cut, and Foolish. Foolish. Why cut Allure? I don't like it. It's kind of more of a win, win more card. Like, it's probably going to get a lot of hate, but like, I've been talking to a lot of people who have cut it, and they said it's just a lot better. Yep. Like, why would you want to get rid of the monsters when you can just use their effects? Yeah. And then Foolish, because, yeah. Because Foolish. It gives you any card in your deck. <laughs> For the traps, I'm playing a minimal amount of traps. Just these. That's all you these. need. I don't play Karma Cut because I hate it. I don't play. Uh, Regeki Break because I hate it. I don't play Emptiness because I hate it. It's just these. That's all you need? Yep. <laughs> uh, it's all Goon and the Hoon. Goon and the Hoon. Goon I like that one. You want the side? Uh, I want the extra deck. Yeah. No, definitely. No, you, you just don't get to see the extra deck. <laughs> Alright. So, the side's actually really important. Okay. Uh, two Virgils. I act like. I don't have a problem playing more than one. Because sometimes it's really needed. sometimes it happens. Like you're gonna play one and it's gonna be going fine, and then you're gonna get to a point where you need another one. You're not gonna have it. Yeah. So I just figured you might as well just have it. 
uh, three of this. Dante. Because of it's very good. Two of this. I was thinking about cutting to one, but I actually make it not more than Quite not. often, yeah. Yeah, because you actually want their effects to go through. Yeah. You know what? I mean, you want to leave them on the field for Fire Lake, but you want the option to where if you don't have Fire Lake. Because yeah. today, I went undefeated without even drawing Fire Lake. Good. So, well, and if they Farfa it, this yeah. comes back with no material. Yeah, and now that Farfa is a thing in the mirror, you actually need two Alucards because they can recycle themselves. Which yep. I'm, I might cut one for a uh, second Nightmare Shark. So Nightmare Shark is just amazing. Levier. I get, I get a lot of hate. I get a lot of hate for this because it's like so useless. People say, but like so many, so, so much stuff is getting banished, especially the sudden chain disappearance, which actually happened today. <laughs> You can bring back your stuff. Like in regionals, in the Seattle regional, I ended up not having anything and tour guide with one target in my deck. Okay. I, was, I tour guided and it was uh, it was tour guide for Rubik. I turned around for Rubik. It sees it into this. Brought back a banished seer. It got back Virgil and then won. Uh, Zen mains because this card is amazing, especially against like Shadow Mirror, Macro, all that oh, stuff. Oh yeah. Fortune Coon because it's busted. Fortune Coon. Fortune Coon. <laughs> Uh, Acid Golem. Acid Golem. Sometimes you have to run it for OTK things. Yeah, and I mean the Alec thing isn't that bad, but I'm cutting Alec, but it's just for OTKs and getting over really big stuff and then... Mechwipped Engineer. Mechwipped Engineer. I've never actually gone into this, but I I just want it just in case. It could be useful sometimes. I, I might cut it for the Mike Bear Shark, maybe. I don't know what I'm going to cut yet, but... <clears throat> it's a work in progress. And then the side, two puppets for the mirror. Yep. Two Veilers for Satellers. Two Flying Seeds for the mirror. Majesties for the mirror, vanities for Shadals. I'm citing a Lydic. No. So what does this guy do again? He summons when he sent to the graveyard. He summons one from your hand and negates its effects. The reason he is actually good side decked. I don't think he's good main decked, but side decked is because of this card. Flying C. So usually you special summon a Burning Abyss and then normal summon your Graph to get its effect. So if they flying see that, you summon this off of Graph and then send this and summon Rubik from your hand. And For then you sure. can synchro, because its effects negated, you can synchro with the flying C. Oh, okay. So it's a way, it's another way to get over flying. Yeah. Uh, creature swap. This is just for locals because there's so many noble knights running around. Yeah. <laughs> I just really want it. And then three wins for the three fairy wins. So why no spell shattering or anything cleaves, like that? The cleaves. This is I, I like it a little bit more. I, a fairy wing. The fairy wins definitely a better card, but you don't you don't think you can find no. it for spell no, shattering? No, because I I have a uh, fire legs and MSTs. Okay. Okay. So for I sure. Understandable. Really Understandable. Understandable. Well, that was Byron Rain's deck. Uh, went undefeated today. Updated burning abyss deck for broke. File. <laughs> Ready for the hate because sometimes it gets it on my channel. But yeah, don't right, forget maybe. to like, comment, and subscribe. I do have a new Shadow list coming up for you guys. And uh, take it easy.